Hi everybody, welcome back to the jewelry spot. I've got something special for you today for Christmas. Keep on watching. Okay, so I've made these pretty little snowmen. I like how they turned out. I've seen people do various things with um, this type of a design and I just kind of put my own spin on it. I had the red scarf there and I just made a little green scarf there on that one. I thought it just turned, so, turned out so cute. Something to spruce up those Christmas sweaters, right? Okay, so what I used was these pearls. I had a set of uh, matte pearls and also, I guess the regular pearls, the, the ones that aren't matte. <laughs> so I, if you watched my hauls, you saw that I, I got lots of strands of pearls in uh, my, my haul videos. So pearls, ribbon, and you know what? I got this at Walmart for, I think it was like a dollar, maybe 74 cents. Not not expensive at all. It's the very, very thin ribbon, but... And then I have different colors in that. So there's green, I've got navy blue. Just, you can do many different uh, colors. I'm thinking I would like to find something that small, but maybe in a plaid ribbon. That, I th think that would be cute. So then I have... Ba uh, Daisy spacer beads and let me see if I can find what those would look like. Mm. Okay, they come in a package like this. These are the spacer beads. That's what they look like. I got those in um, Michaels. And I also found these beads at Michaels. I think they were they were um there was a variety of sizes and I saw the little squares and I thought wow that's perfect so I used that and then of course my head pins and ear wires very very simple but so adorable and cute so what I'm gonna do is start with I'm gonna make the matte pearls I think I'm gonna start with my ear wire and I've got the larger pearl on the bottom smaller one on top like this and then I'm gonna put my daisy spacer and my little snowman's hat just like that and I'm gonna make my my loop at the top I'm going to fix up my loop here, make sure it's tight enough and everything. And now I've got the basic shape of the snowman. And I just have to add my flare and <laughs> my little touch to it, the uh, my little star. So I'm looking for my glue now. I just want to add a dab of glue to the back of him so that it does not fall off. The scarf doesn't come off easily or anything. Okay, so I've got my glue. I'm gonna add a dab to the back. Well, yeah, let me just add a dab to the back of my snowman. Just a dab will do. Now I'm gonna get this quickly try to get it around him and then I'm gonna snip like the excess and that's the snowman's uh, that's his you know the mm, scarf that's his scarf <laughs> And there he is. Uh oh, <laughs> there's the first one. You have to add the ear wire. So, watch this one.
I tried to make the kind of use uh, the ribbons I tried to make my ribbon extra long so that I would have enough room to to tie it don't want to use too much to waste it but uh, you want to use enough so you'll have plenty of um, you know room to tie it off so I'm gonna cut off my excess and there's my second one second snowman ear wires and then I'm all done the thing I like about this is uh, the variety you can do with the ribbon the different um, different kinds of snowmen you can make with the different ribbon that's why I'm inter so interested in seeing if I can find some some of the plaid ribbon that's thin thin enough to fit around the snowman like for a uh, just for a different color of the scarf all of my scarf colors are just uh, you know they're just one color okay so here is my here are the snowman earrings. I think they turned out cute. Okay, I wanted to show you one more thing I did. Okay, I wanted to show you another little set that I made that includes a necklace. As you all know, I love um, blue. It's my favorite color. So I made these first. The little, oh, these got have got to be my favorites. I love navy or, you know, various shades of blue, so. I have this one with the navy blue um, ribbon for the scarf, and then I thought, what if I try to make a pendant? Just messing around, crafting, seeing what I could come up with. So I did. I made a, another one pendant, and now I've got a. It's like a necklace could be a choker or just many different things. So what I have to do now is get some of the ribbon. Uh, like they're little metal things that you use for ribbon. So I have to get some of those. I'm not quite done with this, but I had to show you. I think that's going to turn out very, very nice. So that's what I did with my little snow people. <laughs> I, I'm proud of those. They're easy to make, and then they turn out so cute. So thank you so much for watching. Um, subscribers, I appreciate you so much. Thank you. And I've had such a journey on the channel. I really enjoy making these videos for everyone. Anybody new, welcome. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope you enjoy all of your, your different festivities. And I'll have more to come. Have a great day. Bye-bye.